B92 on Super Important News with Mikey and the Misses. It is brought to you by TDS Telephone, Internet, and TV, all for less than you think. Check them out at hellootds.com. In Iowa, there is a woman who is claiming that her late father, so her father who's passed away, Uh that he was a serial killer. Okay. And she says he is responsible for the deaths of up to 70 women. Whoa. She also is claiming that he, as her father, enlisted her and her sibling to help him move the bodies of the young women that were allegedly buried near a well on his property. So, an investigation is underway. Yeah. And we will find if these claims are true. Yeah. Or if they're not. Right. Did you like that sentence? Thank you. If they are true or if they are not. not. Right. That's interesting. It is. It's fascinating. Hopefully it'll bring some peace to some families if it's true. Yeah. I am in agreement with this, but there's a lady on a podcast that says that she thinks it should be a law, which no one's going to live by. But if you're on your dying bed and you've done something horrific, Mm -hmm. you have to fess up to it before you die. (laughs) (laughs) That's impossible to enforce. No, I get that. But it's like, it just seems like it should be something. Right. Well, here's the other problem. If you fess up to it and then all of a sudden you get better. Yeah, that's That's a big problem for you. That's true. But no, yeah, if you're hanging on to something like that. Yeah. You gotta... You'll be dead. Who cares? Yeah. All it. right. There's uh, some idiot who broke into a radio station. Oh, really? Yeah, but this was in Montana, in Billings, Montana. Really? And decided to steal their radio car. <laughs> <laughs> it was an SUV, <laughs> and it was branded with their station name on it oh, in huge my letters. Oh, gosh. There's a couple... Working for a radio station. Uh-huh. There's a couple of problems here. Well, Yeah. Actually, it might be one of ours. I think it might be a Town Square one. We have stations and buildings. For one thing, it's branded all over the place. It's easy to find, right? Right. That's the obvious part. The second part, if you've ever worked in radio or a lot of companies, you would know that these are the worst shape yeah. company cars that you will ever find. Yeah. And this is true everywhere. Yeah. They, they smell like farts. They're broken all the time. Yeah. The engine light is always on. <laughs> and... It, and when you tell your boss about it, they go, ah, we'll just wrap it again. They, so, good luck, man. <laughs> no, he got caught because someone, of course, spotted the Mix 97.1 on the side of it. <laughs> I think that's ours. <laughs> that's awesome. That's awesome. Uh, he did smoke inside the car, so now it smells like smoke inside. Sure. That's the only thing. Darn. I bet, I bet the DJs were just like, finally, it's yeah. been stolen. Yeah. All right. Uh, and then a lady ordered a fake corpse on Amazon. It was a Halloween decoration. And so there's a link to it that shows this is like, so it's in like a plastic bag and it's tied sure. with duct tape and then you hang it upside down as a Halloween decoration. Yeah. When it came, her 10-year-old son opened up the box and it was not a Halloween decoration. It was a love doll. Oh, no. And then she went back and read the reviews. The majority of people who ordered this for a Halloween decoration are saying, this is a love doll. Like, Yeah, 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 yeah. It's yeah. supposed to be wrapped in a trash bag, but sure. it's not. Oh, dear. Anyway, uh, the mom from Facebook says the seller told her to keep it and then offered a 40% refund. <laughs> Jeez. But she wants a full refund. Oh, and a lot of sanitizer. Yeah. The, all right. Oh, by the way, in case there's kids listening, what a love doll is, is somebody that you go on dates with. It's a Barney it's, doll. I love you. That's exactly what we're you talking about. It's one of those things. Yep. And you just buy it dinner and you have <laughs> yeah. good times. That's all. Yay. We got your back, mom and dad. Stay right there. Hey. Hey. More of B92 One's Mikey and the Mrs. Show is on the way.